Good morning. It is Monday morning, and uh, good to be with you today. Hope everyone is doing well. Uh, let's get started with our devotion today, okay? The Bible says in Psalm 37, verse 5 and verse 6, Commit thy way unto the Lord, trust also in him, and he shall bring it to pass. And he shall bring forth thy righteousness as the light, and thy judgment as the noonday. You know, the Bible says, commit thy way unto the Lord. You know, if there's anything that we are lacking today in our society as a, as a church or as a Christians is commitment. Oh, people, people, you know, they say they love the Lord. They say they, they, uh, they want to do what the Lord would have us, have them to do, but there's not much commitment there. In other words, there's not much determination to do and follow what the Lord would have them to do. Here we find in our text that the Bible says, commit thy way unto the Lord. Boy, I tell you, one of the, one of the hardest things is to get people to uh, commit to the Lord. In other words, be willing to give up their own things, their own desires, and, and commit it to something else or to someone else in this case. But folks, I want to challenge you and I want to encourage you. We can never go wrong when we commit uh, our lives, our ways, our desires unto the Lord. Commit thy way unto the Lord. In other words, commit your way to his way. That's what we're talking about. And oh boy, what a value it is that as a as a man, as a woman, uh, as a uh, uh, older person or a younger person, that we are to learn to commit our way to something or to someone. And I challenge you, commit it unto the Lord. Because we know this, that you and I, we're not going to go wrong. God's not going to mislead us. God's going to reveal the truth uh, and I tell you, the Bible says, and he shall bring forth thy righteousness as the light and thy judgment as the noonday. In other words, we can count on God. God will, God will do what he says he's going to do. And you and I won't be disappointed. But folks, we've got to be willing to commit to the Lord. You know, you know, one of the hardest things to get people to do today is make a commitment. People don't want to commit in their marriage. People don't want to commit in their, in their jobs. People don't want to commit in relationships, uh, uh, you know, of all kinds. But God is faithful. Folks, we ought to be willing to commit to the Lord and commit our way unto him. But what a blessing that will be. So today, I challenge you. As you set out today, as you go about your day, would you make a commitment to the Lord? Would you determine to, to yield over to him? Because that's what God would have you to do. And I promise, I promise you, God will not lead you wrong. God's, God truly knows what he's doing. Would you trust him today? Let's go ahead and have a word of prayer. Father, thank you, Lord. And though we are, uh, many times we are scared, Maybe many times we are, are unknowing of what the future may hold. And so therefore, Lord, we, we struggle with commitment. But Father, we can trust you. We can trust uh, laying our lives in your hands and uh, looking unto you. So Lord, give us strength, give us courage to face this day. And Lord, help us to commit our way to you. Bless us, Father, and thank you. In Jesus' name, amen. May the Lord bless you today, and I encourage you as you continue this day, be committed to the Lord.